Heavenly Father, I thank you, Father God, for waking me up this morning. Father, I thank you for your love. I thank you for your kindness, Lord. I thank you for your mercy. Lord, I thank you for your grace. I thank you for who you are. You are King of Kings and Lord of Lords. You are the Alpha. You are the Omega. You are the beginning. You are the ending. Father, please forgive me of all my sins. Anything I've done to displease you, Father, I repent. Father, cleanse me of all unrighteousness. Father, show me anything in my life that's, that's not pleasing unto you. Father God, and give me the obedience to change. Right now, I cover myself with the blood of Jesus. I cover my soul. I cover my body. I cover my spirit. I cover my family. I cover our home. I cover our possessions with the blood of Jesus. Father, right now, I put on your whole armor in the name of Jesus. I put on the helmet of salvation, the breastplate of righteousness, the belt of truth, the gospel shoes of peace. I hold up the shield of faith and the sword of the spirit, Father God, which is your word in the name of Jesus. And I pray for all the saints. Father, I thank you for your word in Ephesians 6. Father, it says, be prepared. You're up against far more than you can handle on your own. Take all the help you can get, every weapon God has issued, so that when it's all over, but the shouting, you'll still be on your feet. So that when it's all over, but the shouting, you'll be on your feet. Truth, righteousness, peace, faith, and salvation are more than words. Learn how to apply them. You'll need them throughout your life. God's word is an indispensable weapon. In the same way, prayer is essential in this ongoing warfare. Pray hard and long. Pray for your brothers and sisters. Keep your eyes open. Keep each other's spirits up so that no one falls behind or drops out. And don't forget to pray for me. In the name of Jesus, Father, I thank you for your word. Glory to God. Father, you said to be strong. You are strong and you want us to be strong. Father God, so we take everything you have set out for us, well-made weapons of the best materials. Father, you want us to put them to use so that we're able to stand up against everything the devil throws our way. Father, I thank you. This is no weekend war that we'll walk away from and forget about in a couple of hours. This is for keeps a life or death fight to finish against the devil and all his angels and so we must be prepared in the name of Jesus because we're up against far more than we can handle on our own father we take all the help we, you, you're given to us we take every weapon that you've issued father God in the name of Jesus so that we can stand on our feet when it's all said and done father I thank you for truth righteousness peace faith and salvation father God they're more than just words. These are your spirits that you've given to us, oh God. Father, teach us how to apply them all throughout our lives because we will need them. These are your indispensable weapons, Father God. We take them up right now in the name of Jesus. Father, we understand that it's the effectual fervent prayers of a righteous man that avail it much. Prayer is essential in this ongoing warfare. And so we pray hard and long. We pray for everybody. Father, right now I lift up my students and my children to you in the name of Jesus. Father, I cover them with the blood of Jesus. Father, I ask, oh God, that you please forgive them of all their sins. Father, forgive the sins in the bloodline. Send your warrior angels, your ministering angels to help them, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Father God, they belong to my household and I bless them with the blessings of Abraham, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Father, you said the sanctified spouse make the whole house holy, even the children. They are holy. They are under, Father God, our ministry. You have assigned them to us. And so, Father, I thank you that they have been redeemed from the curse of the law. I release Galatians 3 upon them in the name of Jesus. Father, I destroy anything that's coming against the children. Open up their eyes, Father God. Reveal Christ to them in the name of Jesus. The same way you revealed Christ to Peter, Father God. 
Father. And so right now we use the keys of the kingdom and we destroy, Father. We completely burn down every plantation, Father, of destruction, demonic destruction, death, Father, addiction, confusion, fear, rejection, Father, vagabond, Father God, in the name of Jesus, the orphan spirits, poverty, idolatry, witchcraft, rebellion, Jezebel, Ahab, Athalia, marine spirits, Father God. We bind them and cast them out, Father. We burn them down with the fiery hammer of your word of God. We pulverize perversion. We pulverize lust and pride, every generational curse. Father God, we destroy them. We trample them. We chain them with the blood and we drop them into the brimstone abyss. But we, we set the children free right now in the name of Jesus, Father God. We wash them in the blood. We wash their souls, their spirits, their lives, oh God, their destiny, their purpose, Father, according to Jeremiah 29 and verse 11, Father, we wash them for your plan is to prosper them and not to harm them. Your plan is to give them hope and a future. You know the plans you have for them, oh God. And so, Lord, I ask that you go back to the womb, oh God, and begin to heal them in the name of Jesus. We, Father, we burn up every written curse, time release curse, spoken curse that's been released against our children, our students, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Every negative word I destroy with the blood I burn up right now I uproot them but father I release your word your word father God that they will not die but live to declare the works of the living God father you said in the last days you will pour out your spirit upon all flesh and our sons and daughters will prophesy and so I release love upon them I release faith and holiness upon them I release shalom peace upon them I father I release freedom and life upon them in the name of Jesus, I release sound mind. You have not given them a spirit of fear, but of love, power, and a sound mind. In the name of Jesus, Father God, we bind and cast out, Father God, every false religion. Father, any 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 lust and perversion, we bind a strong man. Every lie, every deception, Father, every ancestral spirit, Father, we bind them and cast them out. Father God, we set the children free today in the name of Jesus. Father God, we command, Father, all hereditary spirits father every rejection to be broken off of them father God we bind every rejection and cast them out every sickness disease infirmity father every rage every bitterness father every suicidal spirit father every depression we bind them the confusion the failure father we bind and cast them out into the brimstone abyss but we release oh God self-control upon the children we release your truth we buckle their lives up with the truth father God we we dip them in the truth, oh God. We pour your truth in them. In the name of Jesus, we pour your love, Father God, in them. We speak divine order over them. They walk in your will. They walk in your way. They read the Bible. They attend a godly church, Father God. They have godly mentors. In the name of Jesus, Father God, I thank you. Glory to God. Glory to God that they're wealthy in your love, wealthy in your truth, wealthy in your obedience, wealthy in in, Father, your humility, humility, they're wealthy, wealthy, wealthy in joy, 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 wealthy in peace, peace. I break off sorrow off of them. I bind every sorrow, every tormenting spirit off of them, every deception, every lie of the enemy. I break, break, break right now with the fiery hammer of the word of God. I pulverize any Jericho wall of lies in the school system, Father God, in the judicial system, in our government, Father God. God, I break it down every lie in the household, in the bloodline. I purge their bloodline. I purify them with the blood of Jesus. Father God, the enemy has no more legal rights to attack our children or our students. In the name of Jesus, the curse is broken. Jesus became a curse for us, Lord. Remember your word. The enemy no longer can attack them. I bind familiar spirit, witchcraft spirit. Father God, in the name of Jesus, I tear them up. Father God, I, I, I ask that you send your warrior angels right now, right now, right now, right now, Lord, in the name of Jesus. I rebuke every witchcraft that's attacking our children, attacking the students. Father, I thank you that they are set free, set free, set free, set free, set free. Set free in the name of Jesus, Father God, every false 
unbelief, every stronghold, every wicked doctrine. Father, every deception, manipulation, domination, intimidation, I bind you. I uproot you. I drop you in the blood fill, atomic bomb, blood fill, brimstone of the word of God. I destroy you. I trample on serpents and scorpions and over all the powers of devil and nothing shall by any means hurt the children. I break all curse off of them. I break all curse off of them. I, I bless them. They belong to you, Father God. Father, I thank you that the blessing, I thank you that the blessings of Abraham is upon them. They are the children of Abraham, Father. They are your children. Father God, forgive any sin in the bloodline where, the, where there have been, Father God, any robbery, any mishandling of money. Father, break the curse of poverty, mammon off of their lives and release the wealth upon them, all that they need financially. Father, release every resource upon our children. Father God, give them the best medical care, the best food, the best places to live, the best school supply, Father, the best school, the best jobs, the best opportunity. Father God, begin to release obedience upon them. And Father, Father God, you said if we be willing and obedient, we will eat the best of the land. And so, Father, I break, 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 Father God, every curse, Father, of lack off of them. They are no longer in Lodabar, but they're in the palace with you, Father God, in the name of Jesus. I bind sickness. I destroy the curse of infirmity, sickness, disease off of them. Father, they, they leave their bodies now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I bind them and cast them out. I release health and wealth upon the children. Father God, in the name of Jesus, they are blessed. Father God, I bind Leviathan, every pride that's keeping them with that narcissistic personality. I bind them and cast them out. They don't, Father God, they are humble. They are humble today. They walk humbly before you in wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. They walk in the truth, Father God. They do not have a high opinion about themselves, Father God, but they only exalt you. King of kings and Lord of lords, they are fully surrendered. Father, convict their hearts. Remove the hearts of stone and give them an obedient, Father, holy heart. In the name of Jesus, Father God, break every demonic covenant off their life, oh God, off of their lives. Any demonic oaths and vows, Father, any demonic pact by the devil with the devil, Father God, that he made with their family, their, their bloodline. Father God, we destroy it. We burn it up in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I break all curses off of their lives and I bless them. I bless them in the name of Jesus. Father God, begin to expose every enemy. Let them see the enemy. Every satanic agent. Father, demonic music and artists. Father God, Father, anybody that they're looking up to that's demonic, begin to reveal them. Father God, show them the true spirit and nature of everybody. Give them discerning of spirit in the name of Jesus. Open their eyes today. I speak Ephetha. Ephetha. Oh, Father, like Bartimaeus, they're seeing the truth. They're seeing the truth. Like Bartimaeus, they're seeing the truth in the name of Jesus. And they're walking in the way of your commandments starting now. Father, they're fully surrendered, Father. They're saying, not my will, but your will be done. For thine is the power, Father God, and the glory, Father God. Thine is the kingdom forever. The kingdom, the kingdom belongs to you, oh God. And they're in your kingdom and they have the keys of the kingdom. In the name of Jesus, they are your end time warriors. Your battle acts, your battering ram, the children. Begin to wake them up, stir them up. Let your word be fire in their bones. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Father God, I thank you. That they're set free, set free from every time release curse, Father God. In the name of Jesus. Lord, I thank you that they are the ones who study the word. Uh, Father God, pray the word. Uh, they live the word. They live the word. Uh, the rebellion is gone, Father God. They will no longer resist you, but they resist the devil and he flees now. Uh, they seek first your kingdom and your righteousness, oh God. And all that they need is being added unto them in the name of Jesus. Father God, protect the children. Father God, surround them with your warrior angels. Let Psalm 91, oh God, be their birthright forever. No evil will come near their dwelling. No evil people no evil ideas father God nothing wicked would be able to reach them father in the name of Jesus let not the enemy track or trace them I bind marine spirit I bind monitoring spirit father I cast them out into the brimstone abyss in the name of Jesus our children dwell in safety and nothing shall make them afraid and so right now I bind that strong man of lawlessness I come against lawlessness the book of Deuteronomy 16 and verse 18 father God you said appoint judgment Judges and officials for each of your tribes in every town the Lord your God is giving you and they shall judge the people fairly 
But Father God, there's been lawlessness in the land. Uh, like Judges 21, 25, in the book of Judges 21 and verse 25, it says, In those days Israel had no king, and everyone did as they saw fit. And so, Father God, I thank you that we are surrendered to you in the name of Jesus. Father, I thank you that you are the King of kings and Lord of lords over our lives, over the lives of our children. And we will not do whatever we want. We will not do whatever that seemed right in our own eyes. Father God, because there's a way that seemed right unto a man. But in the end, it's death and destruction. But Father God, you are our king. When we're led by your spirit, our children, are, they're led by your spirit and your spirit alone. There will be no more God, godlessness. There will be no more lawlessness. Because 1 John 3, 4 says, everyone who sins breaks the law. In fact, sin is is lawlessness and so we come against lawlessness and sinfulness in the name of jesus father god begin to reveal to our children the, the sin the sin father god that's in their lives in the name of jesus reveal it father god there will be no more rowdy spirit there will be no more unruly spirit disorderly spirit bad behaving spirit i bind and cast you out every riotous spirit every rioting unrestrainable spirit every undisciplined spirit i bind and cast you out rebellion stubbornness disobedience unmanageable spirit unmanageable spirit uncontrollable spirit ungo un ungovernable spirit ungovernable spirit uncontrolled spirit no our children have self-control we have self-control we have self control every disruptive spirit I bind and cast you out every wild spirit turbulent spirit lawlessness boisterous spirit I bind and cast you out in the name of Jesus every rambunctious spirit I bind and cast you out I release shalom peace I release shalom peace upon our children their their bloodline is shalom peace they have wholeness and wellness they have tranquility and harmony with you father a sound mind I destroyed the stronghold every demonic thought in the name of Jesus father God soak their minds father we your shalom peace and put the helmet of salvation upon them in the mighty name of jesus christ lord i thank you glory to god father god let your power surge through them now father in the name of jesus i bind every strong man of jealousy that's coming against them every envy every bitterness unforgiveness every vengeful spirit every violent spirit rage and murder spirit i bind and cast you out father, father i cast them out in the name of jesus in the name of Jesus, Father, I release love upon our children. Father, wisdom, so they can be able to, 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 to know which way to go. Discerning of spirits, Father, let them discern when people are jealous and envious and covetous, Father, against them. Father, God, open their eyes and protect them. May they not go the way of wickedness. May they walk the straight and narrow on repeat, Father, in the name of Jesus. I bind the strong men of lying, deception, falsehood false religions false doctrine deception i bind and cast you up i release truth upon the children they see the truth they understand that they need to study father study your words study their schoolwork. they understand that they need to eat right live right they hear the truth they hear you speaking to them effort to their ears effort to their eyes is they're wide open now effort to their hearts and spirits father god they're open to you, but they close themselves, Father, when it comes to wickedness. We come against every witchcraft that's attacking the children. Every obia, divination. Father, we bind them. Clairvoyant spirits, mediums, spells, curses, hexes, potions, powders, whatever chance. We destroy them with the blood. We burn them to ashes, demonic altars, demonic sacrifices, every ley line, silver cord, evil eggs, wicked seeds. We burn you up. Every demonic offering, covenants, vows, every occult practice, we burn you at the roots. And we reveal, Father God, we, we ask you to reveal to the children the truth about familiar spirits and witchcraft. Father God, expose every witchcraft that's in their lives. Expose the witches and warlocks, Father. You said a witch is not supposed to live. Father God, we ask that you remove anything or anyone that will try to kill their divine godly purpose. In the name of Jesus, protect the children. Protect our families, oh God. Father, I bind the strong men of perversion. We come against sexual immorality, every fornication, every, every adultery. Father God, and any pornography, Father God, and any confusion against their sexuality, we bind those spirits. Every, and Father God, every prostitution, 
Father God, anything that's not of you, we bind the perversion, cast them out. We release holiness, self-control upon our children. Father, they will not practice the forbidden. They will not eat from the forbidden tree of fruit, Father God, in the name of Jesus. They eat from the tree of life and they have the fruit of the spirit, love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, self-control. Father God, they are rooted and grounded in your love. They are planted by the water of your word, Father God, and they, they find their identity in Jesus. They hunger and thirst after your righteousness, your holiness. And so I bind every strong man of heaviness every depression, despair, oppression, hopelessness, fatigue, exhaustion, paranoia, mental illness, mental illness. I bind and cast you out. Father, I release the oil of gladness, the anointing to destroy the yokes of bondage. I release your joy. I put the garment of praise in our children, the robe of salvation. Father, right now, I cover them with the blood. In the name of Jesus, there will be no more lawlessness. There will be no more heaviness or perversion. There will be no more familiar spirits tormenting them. The enemy can no longer track or trace them or, or illegally trespass against us. I come against the lion spirit, jealousy spirit. They can never come back. Every spirit of harlotry, whoredom, I bind and cast them out. Demons that are competing with God, I bind and cast you out. Idolatry and harlotry, bind and cast you out. Pride, pride, love of money, the love of this world, I bind and cast you out. Who, Lord, deliver the children, deliver our home, our homes. Father, deliver us, deliver us from corruption, from corru corruption. Let us not go the way of the world where they're dressing their flesh up and their spirits are ugly and nasty. Father God, wash us seven times in the water of your word. Make us clean, Father God. I bind the strong men of infirmity off of the children, off of us. Every controlling spirit that's, that's attaching sickness and disease, ailments upon them. I bind and cast your every disability every disability I bind and cast you out I release healing I release healing by the stripes of Jesus we are healed I come against every pain and trauma that's in the body right now every terminal illness every death spirit I bind and cast you out into the abyss Father God begin to heal the children begin to heal our bodies repair us until we recover all in the name of Jesus healing is the children's bread healing is the children's bread in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus a spirit of harlotry that's competing against God I bind you your time is up and all associated evil strong men get out go to the brimstone abyss in the name of Jesus dumb and deaf spirit come against you our children can hear there's no more deafness there's no more dumbness there's no more speech loss there's no more convulsion I bind and cast you out epilepsy anything that's out of order I command you to go I speak order to our souls our spirits our bodies our minds will and emotions I speak divine order to the school system every classroom every house every home Divine order, divine godly order, manifest now in the name of Jesus. I come against the spirit of fear. I bind and cast you out. Every anxiety, every phobia that's coming against the children, coming against the families. Compulsive behavior, insomnia, terror, anguish, nightmares, every fear, every paranoia. I bind and cast you out. Every phobia. God has not given us a spirit of fear, but of love, power, and a sound mind. I bind and cast you out. I burn down the plantation of fear. I uproot you now and burn you to ashes. We walk in faith. We walk by faith. We walk in love. Perfect love casts out fear. There will be no more terror. There will be no more lawlessness. We shut every wicked, wicked door and seal them with the blood of Jesus. And we open up the blessed doors of heaven. Father, release confidence, godly confidence, godly strength, godly hope. Father God, re release it now. Godly order. Release forgiveness. Father God, re re release, release, release it now. Release the healing, release the healing, release the healing. Burn up the trauma, Father. Release the healing. Release the healing. Release the healing. 
Let them not remember what was said to them that, was, that, that has been bothering them. The, the evil words, the evil words. The e silence them, silence them, silence them now. In the name of Jesus, every memory recall, anything that they're remembering that's not of you, Father God. Father God, may they forget in the name of Jesus. Because you're blessing them so good like you did with Joseph. Let them not remember all the hell and trauma. Only your love and your blessings and the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding from their testimony. I bind every strong man of pride, haughtiness, arrogance, narcissistic spirits. I bind and cast you out, self-righteous spirit, refusing to listen. Jezebel, Abathalia, I bind and cast you out, and I release humility upon the children. They walk in the righteousness of Jesus Christ. But I thank you that they're, ob they're obedient. They're quick to listen, slow to speak, and slow to become angry. I bind the strong men of bondage. I bind and cast them out, Father, into the brimstone abyss in the name of Jesus. I release truth upon the children. I release your Holy Spirit, Father God. You said where the Spirit of the Sovereign Lord God is, there is liberty. Father God, I ask that anything that's not of you, any demonic domination, manipulation, Father God, intimidation, addiction, Father OCD, we bind them and cast them out in the name of Jesus. But we release, oh God, your love upon the children, your truth, your truth. Show them the truth. Show them what's right and what's wrong. Show them what's godly and what's not. Father God, remove all cult and false religion, religious spirit off of them. Every mind controlling spirit, we bind and cast them out. Any bullying, any evil relationship, demonic system, Father God, pulverize them. Remove them from our children. Remove them from us, oh God, in the name of Jesus. Every spirit of Antichrist, the strong man of Antichrist, every cult, Every wicked religion, Father, that's out there that rejects Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior, that rejects the Trinity, the Holy Trinity, Father God, anything, remove them now. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Lord, I thank you. Lord, I praise your holy name. I pray for our children who are dealing with narcissistic spirit, Father God. Help them, Lord. In the name of Jesus, we pulverize them now. Father, we love you and not some idolized, grandiose, golden image of ourselves. We resist, reject, and renounce all false image of pride concerning ourselves. Teach this to our children. We bind narcissistic spirits, Father God. We crucify our flesh. Father God, heal us of all insecurities. Heal the children of all insecurities. And Father God, give them an abundance of security in you in the name of Jesus. We bind and cast out the deceptions and the delusions in the name of Jesus. Every dysfunctional demonic habit, pattern, and season, we pulverize with the fiery hammer of the word of God. Father God, cleanse us and our children of self-centered behaviors, arrogant strongholds, cravings of admiration, lack of empathy, and all evil roots of pride. Leviathan, Father God, heal us now. Our identity is in, the, in Jesus and the work of the cross. In the name of Jesus, Leviathan sees everything that is high. And he's the, the small K-I-N-G king over all the sons of pride. But Father God, we are the sons of righteousness. We are the sons of peace. The sons, the children of humility and obedience to Yahweh. Father God, you said pride goes before destruction and a haughty spirit before a fall. We humble ourselves before a downfall. The heart is haughty, but humility comes before honor. Father, you said when pride comes, then comes disgrace. But with humility comes wisdom. We humble ourselves and we walk in your wisdom. Our children, they walk in your wisdom and they will not be disgraced. They will not have a downfall because today on this day, Father God, you're giving them humility through your truth. You're giving them humility. There will be no destruction because you're showing them the way to go. And they have clarity and they have 
our love and hunger for you. Father, we gave our children back to you. We're giving them back to you now, the students. They belong to you, Father God. We clothe them with your truth. Wisdom's instruction is to fear the Lord and humility comes before honor. We clothe them with the fear of the Lord. We clothe them with humility. We trample selfishness. Father, cockiness, manipulation, witchcraft, we bind and cast them out. But we welcome godly change. Father, we will not blame others for our issues. We come to you and you give us the understanding. You give us the deliverance. You give us the healing and we forgive and let people go. Father, teach our children to forgive. Father, clothe them with forgiveness. They will no longer be sensitive. We will no longer be sensitive. But Father God, we're hidden in you, overflowing with your love. Out of our bellies are flowing, your Father, life, overflowing wisdom, security. I thank you, oh God. There's no more rejection. We're loved. We will not lose control. Father God, when problems arise and disobedience, the, 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 the disagreements arise, we will not lose control. We're going to recognize what's not of you. Resist the devil and he will flee. We will not lose control. Our children will no longer lose control. We are controlled by your spirit, Father God. Release the Holy Spirit. Fill us up with your Holy Spirit, Father God, in the name of Jesus. We give no more room to narcissism. Father, restore our souls, our minds, will and emotions. Heal the foundations of our lives, oh God. Fill us up with your Holy Spirit right now, Father God. Let us overflow with the spirit of life, the spirit of truth, Father God. Help us to overflow with love. The greatest commandment in the law is for us to love the Lord our God with all of our hearts, with all of our soul, with all our minds and strength, Father God. And the second is like it, to love our neighbor as ourselves. That's, that's the fulfillment of the law. Father, pour love upon the children today, Father God, where they feel whole. We will not be rejected, Father God. But we live, Father, in your presence. Father, you lead us to the path of life. In your presence, there's fullness of joy. And at your right hand, there are pleasures forevermore. We will not manipulate people's feelings. We walk in love. Our children will not be, will not be manipulators. They walk in love. They're controlled by you. They allow you, Father, to control every situation to control them. They will no longer draw attention to themselves, but they'll keep a spotlight on you. Abba, we are whole by your love and shalom peace. In the name of Jesus, Lord, I thank you that this is the day we're seeing miracle signs and wonders. We're seeing deliverance for the children. An immediate deliverance is taking place for the children. I thank you, Father God, that there's no more rage, no more unforgiveness, no more hatred, no more Jezebel, Haman, no more Haman. Father God, we impale every wicked Haman that's coming against the children, every Ahab, Athalia, Marine Spirit. We thank you that they're gone. The rebellion, stubbornness, disobedience, the witchcraft, they're gone. The pride, the curses, deception, perversion, bondage, mental illness, they're gone. The schizophrenia, the dumb and deafness spirit, Father, the destruction. Premature death, they're gone. Evil strong men, strongholds, they're gone. Our children are set free by the blood. They're free right now indeed in the name of Jesus. Every evil root is destroyed, Father God. I thank you that your, the word, your word is rooted and grounded in them. We plant the seed of your word into the soil of their hearts. Father, I thank you that the demonic ropes and chains and yokes are destroyed. Demonic prisons, ley lines, plantations, strongholds, they're burnt to ashes. According to Jeremiah 23 and 29, Father, your fiery hammer, the fiery hammer of your word has pulverized the enemies of our children in the name of Jesus. Lord, I thank you that the anointing has destroyed every bondage from them, whatever the bondage has been. They're set free at superluminal speed, Father. They're set free with your truth at superluminal speed. And I thank you that our children overflow with love, joy, peace, obedience, holiness, knowledge, wisdom, understanding, humility, life, healing, sound mind, and blessings. They honor their mothers and fathers in the days of longing the earth. They're teachable. They're docile in the name of Jesus. They have godly divine order. Godly healing manifests now. Father, raise them up as your apostles, your prophets, your evangelists, your pastors, and your teachers. In the name of Jesus, Father, send your warrior angels to pierce the hearts of every evil spirit that's been coming against our children. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, 
I thank you, O oh God, that there will be no backlash or retaliation against this prayer. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Lord, I thank you. Lord, I praise your holy name. Father, I thank you that you're worthy to receive all glory, honor, and praise. Father God, we we commit our lives to you right now. We pledge our allegiance to you right now in the name of Jesus. Father, I thank you that your Holy Spirit is praying through us right now, showing us what to pray for. I thank you, oh God, that we let go of the past because behold, behold, you're doing a new thing in the children and in us. It's springing up now and we perceive it. You're giving us water of healing, water of peace, water of restoration right now water of truth oh God I thank you I thank you oh God that you sent Jesus Christ into this world to die as a substitute so that we will be redeemed we're redeemed from every curse we're redeemed Father God from dysfunctional families we're redeemed from destruction we are redeemed from every curse we're redeemed Father, I thank you that Jesus Christ is at your right hand and we are seated together in heavenly places with Christ Jesus far above every wickedness. We are completely forgiven. Our children, they're completely forgiven. On this day, you're saving those who were not saved. On this day, Father God, in the name of Jesus, you're sending your angel, Father God, in their rooms. Father, wherever they are on this day, this is the day where you're doing it, oh God, on 2-4-2023, you're doing it. This is the day wherever they find themselves. As I'm praying this prayer, Father God, open the floodgates of heaven and pour down salvation upon them in the name of Jesus. Jesus, thank you, oh God. Thank you, oh God, that Jesus Christ is their perfect righteousness and they are justified by faith and they have peace with you through their Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Thank you, oh God, that we have been made complete because of Jesus. You offer Jesus. He's our daily bread. Oh God, healing is the children's bread. Healing is the children's bread and anything or anyone that's causing confusion in their lives. Father God, put your millstone around their necks and drown them. Every wicked enemy. In the name of Jesus, open up our eyes, oh God. To see how great, Father God, that you are. Open our eyes. You are our provision. Father, I thank you. You are our children's provision. In the name of Jesus. We have the victory through Jesus Christ. We're thankful that the victory that Jesus won for us on the cross, Father God, is still, is still applicable, Father God. We stand in his resurrection and we are seated together in heavenly places with Christ Jesus, far above principalities, far above wicked powers far above all wicked spirits we bind them and cast them out in the name of jesus father i thank you that our children they're armored up they're armored up father god the fiery darts of the enemy are destroyed they walk by faith and not by sight in the name of jesus they are your joshua's father god they fight the good fight of faith they are the the, the three hebrew boys they will not bow down to wickedness and you're in a fiery furnace with them, purifying them, purging them today. In the name of Jesus, Father God, your son is the fourth man in the fire with them, oh God. And they are praising you, unbound, unharmed, Father God. And they will never smell like smoke, Father. You protect them. You protect them. You, you protect them, Lord. In the name of Jesus. I pray this for every student that I've ever taught, every foster child that we ever fostered. I pray this for my own children, my bloodline, our church, the body of Christ, Lord, in the name of Jesus. I thank you, oh God, that we have complete dependence on you. Even as we're praying right now, we are relying on the Holy Spirit to reveal to us what we need to pray for, oh God. I thank you, Heavenly Father. That Jesus Christ spoiled all principalities and evil powers. And Father God, he embarrassed them openly, triumphing over them. 
when he got back up with all power on the third day lord i thank you that our tombs are open up our children's tomb father god we take the brave clothes off of them and we say live in the name of jesus Father, shut the mouths of the lions that's been coming against them, Lord. Shut the mouths of the lion that's been coming against them, Lord. And, and throw their enemies in the lion's den, Father God, where the enemy, where, they, where, the, where the lions will eat their bones, crush their bones, and swallow every wickedness. But deliver our children. Deliver them, Father. We claim all that victory, Father God, the, the victory of Jesus. We claim it now. We are your victorious ones. Our children are victorious. In the name of Jesus. And forever and ever, our children and us will reject all lies of the enemy. We reject all insinuation. Father, every temptation, every accusation we destroy, we burn the tongue of the enemy. Father, no weapon formed against us will prosper. And every tongue that rises up against us in judgment, we have a right to condemn. Father, we speak your truth and we are set free in the name of Jesus. You are our provision. You are our daily bread, oh God. You are our healer, Lord. You are Yahweh Rapha. You're Yahweh Jireh. Yahweh Nisi, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Your word is true. Your word is alive, oh God. It's, and, and it's manifested today. We choose to live today in your word in your will father God in the light of your word in the name of Jesus we choose to obey you our eyes are open father God in the name of Jesus we choose to please you today in the name of Jesus we take a stand for righteousness our children take a stand for righteousness Lord they don't want the world but they hunger and thirst after your word that is their daily bread they take off the old man. We take off the old man. And we put on Christ. In the name of Jesus. Father by faith. By faith Father God. We resist the old. We, we step into Christ. We're in Christ. If any man be in Christ. We're in Christ. He's a new creation. Old things are passed away. Behold all things are new. We put on the new man. And we stand in victory. The victory of the resurrection Father God. Lord, you are our resurrection and our provision. In the name of Jesus, he did that for us. So we can live holy. We live holy, oh God. We put off the old nature of selfishness. And Father God, we're selfless before you. We walk in your love. We put off the old nature of fear. And we step forward bold as a lion in your faith, oh God, in faith. Thank you, oh God. We put off the old nature of rebellion. Father God, we bow down. We cover ourselves with humility and obedience. With your truth, we resist the old man of, of, of lust and deception. Father God, we step into the new man, the new person of righteousness and purity. Our children, they step into the new. Oh God, we dip them in the water of your word and they emerge brand new. In the name of Jesus, I thank you, oh God. We stand in victory, oh God. Oh God, we stand in victory today. We're your victorious ones. In the name of Jesus, Lord, break down every idol. Father God, show us anything that's an idol in our lives, oh God, and we choose to let them go. We pulverize them with the fiery hammer of your word pick up our cross, deny ourselves, and we follow you today in the name of Jesus. Father, I thank you that you've blessed our children and us with all spiritual blessings in heavenly places so we can live holy. And the spirit of truth inside of us is showing us what to do, what not to do, what to say. Father, I thank you for destroying the demonic dreams and, and everything that's been trying to manipulate us. Destroy them. Father, thank you for releasing your prophetic dreams upon us. Oh God, I thank you that your angels are showing us great miracle signs and wonders. Today, we're getting ready to see the revival of the Most High God as we do all night prayer tonight, Father, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, oh God. I thank you, oh God. Father, you are our living hope. I thank you, oh God. That we have your joy, we have your love. I thank you, Lord. That we have, we have strength to go on now. Our children are strong in you, oh God. And we're strong in you, oh God. We will not be led by our emotions. We give you our souls, our minds, willing emotions, oh God. We take up the shield of faith. Father God, we walk by faith. We walk by what your word says. In the name of Jesus, 
open up our eyes like you did Balaam. Father, let the donkeys speak to our children today and they will no longer beat the truth. They will no longer beat against the word, but they will obey so that they can live in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, Balaam was going the wrong way, but the donkey was able to see that the angel was standing there with the sword drawn, ready to kill him. And so the donkey wouldn't move. Father, I thank you for sending divine destiny helpers to help our children on this day and forever to help us in the name of Jesus. Lord, I thank you that our children fully surrender to you. We fully surrender to you, Father God. We offer up our lives, our bodies as a living sacrifice unto you, holy and acceptable and pleasing in your sight. That's our reasonable act of worship. We will not conform to this world, but we are transformed by the renewing of our minds by studying your words. Renew the minds of the husbands and, and the wives, of the mothers, the fathers, the children. Renew our minds, oh God. Help us to walk the path of righteousness. Help us, oh God, to think with the new minds of Christ and not our own minds. Renew us today. Renew our minds with your truth today, Father. Help us to read the word. Give us a deeper desire to read the word and to renew our minds. In the name of Jesus, help us to understand spiritual things, that the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, but mighty through you, Father God, for the pulling down of strongholds, to the casting down of imaginations, every high thing that exalted itself against knowledge of God, and bringing every thought into obedience to the Lord Jesus Christ. Help us, oh God, to monitor our thoughts. Help us to recognize when the thought is not of you, and help us to resist the devil, and he will flee. We tear down the strongholds. We smash every, de every demonic plot, plan, scheme of the enemy. No weapon formed against us will prosper. We tear down the strongholds in our minds and we surrender our minds to the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus. Lord, I thank you. We will not be emotional today. We will not be emotional today. We will never again be led by our emotions. We're led by the Holy Spirit. In the name of Jesus. Lord, I thank you. We give our bodies to you right now. Our bodies are the temples of the living God. We surrender, oh God. In the name of Jesus. Father, I thank you that our ability to discern has increased, Father God, exponentially, oh God. We're able to discern at superluminal speed. We're able to recognize when people are speaking your words or, or words of, of, of the enemy. I thank you, oh God, that our children are able to look at, look at people and see if they're of you or not. I thank you, oh God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God that we're able to recognize every counterfeit spirit. Every lying spirit. In the name of Jesus. Father, help us to, 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 to take a stand like Job, even when we're going through the fiery furnace of life. Because you're giving us double for our trouble. You're giving us twice as much, oh God, that we had before. Because we're praying, praying. It's the effectual, fervent prayers of a righteous man that are very much, Father God. We're praying like Job, and you have turned our captivities in the name of Jesus, you've turned the captivities of our children. Father, I thank you that we shall see them preaching the gospel. We shall see them evangelizing. We shall see them prophesying. We shall see them praying and fasting. We shall see them running your churches, establishing churches all around the world. We shall see them on fire, oh God, and great miracle signs and wonders will follow them. We shall see them excelling in school. We shall see them being respectful. We shall see and see them giving honor and honor is due. We shall see them walking in their godly purpose. We shall see them confident in you. We shall see them, Father, Father God, filled with your joy, leaping from the stalls, oh God, dancing in the spirit, oh God, singing prophetically. We shall see them. The son of righteousness is shining upon the children with healing in his wings. In the name of Jesus, they shall enter their classroom, sit down, and they will be organized with their notebooks, pencils, and their supplies, oh God, ready to learn. You've opened up their minds 
times where they're not fighting against themselves. No more self-sabotage. They're going to sit down and pray attention. They're going to sit down and take their notes. They're not going to be following the crowd. Father God, they're going to be godly leaders. They're going to sit down and be respectful. They're going to pass every test. Father God, I thank you that they are like Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. Ten times smarter than the rest. Oh God, I thank you. Hallelujah. We shall hear the testimonies. We shall hear. There will be no more learning disabilities. No more learning disabilities. Uh, in the name of Jesus, by the stripes of Jesus, they are healed. Uh, they're getting the best scholarship, full scholarship, getting into the best schools. Uh, in the name of Jesus, the thief has been caught. He must give them back seven times what he has stolen from them. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, the wealth of the wicked is transferred to our children. Lord, I thank you that every held up blessing is located in them now. They will never be homeless. They will never be destitute. Father, I thank you that you're releasing the man. You are their provision, oh God. You are their source and their resource, oh God. You're giving them a ramp in the bush. Father, I thank you. Glory to God that their bloodline is the bloodline of Jesus Christ from this day forward in the name of Jesus I pray this for my students father I pray for this city I pray for my city Lord I ask for revival I bind the principalities oh of racism discrimination witchcraft mm, I bind you cast you out the marine spirits I bind and cast you out the vile lawlessness spirit that's been plaguing plaguing that city. I bind and cast you out. The dumb and deaf spirit that's been plaguing that city. I bind and cast you out in the name of Jesus. Father, remove anything or anyone in the school, the, the school system, the, the classroom that's not of you. Fire them now, Father, and put your righteous principals and superintendents and teachers and teachers assistants and bus drivers and cafeteria workers. The, the schools shall be the church. Lord, send your angels now. The schools shall be the place of worship. Because the righteous are being positioned in the schools. I decree, I declare it. And the wicked are being moved out. Every witch, every warlock. Father, that evict them now. Now fire them now. Those who've been there attacking the children, sent to disrupt your spirit, the lawlessness spirit. We bind and cast you out into the brimstone abyss. Remove them today. But Father God, begin to raise up the godly educators. Oh, the godly Josephs. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Oh, the godly Daniels. So every classroom, school bus, oh God, with the blood of Jesus, we cover every fund, the money for the schools with the blood of God. Let your will be done. Father, we're asking, oh God, that you begin, Father God, to stir the children up to want to learn, oh God, and give the teachers prophetic assignments, prophetic lessons, oh God, send the money for field trips to take place, oh God, where they can travel, travel and learn, take field trips around the world. In the name of Jesus, send the funds, oh God, and send Joseph to manage the money. Oh God, protect the funds from the greedy ones. In the name of Jesus, we ask them for turn around in the schools. Turn around in the homes. Where parents are volunteering in the schools. I thank you, oh God, for the for the the the, 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 the new thing you're doing, the gutting, the new thing you're doing in the schools. In the name of Jesus, oh God. Send godly nurses in the schools, oh God. Godly principals, godly assistant principals, godly math teachers, godly science teachers, oh God. Godly history teachers, godly musicians. Oh God, empower your teachers. Oh God. 
God needs security. We're asking, oh God, for hope. Metamorphosis in the schools in the name of Jesus. Oh God, send your angels to stand in every classroom. I pray this specifically for the sea that you've shown me, oh God. Oh Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus, remove the chains. Oh God, release life life more abundantly in our homes upon our own children heal them and deliver them oh god wake them up delete the coom delete the coom arise from the bed of rebellion arise from the bed of evil relationships arise from the bed of addiction arise from the bed of perversion arise from the bed of destruction to lead the coom and live for God live for God for I know the plans I have for you declares the Lord plans to prosper you and not to harm you plans to give you hope and a future arise pick up your mantle pick up your cross and follow God in the name of Jesus prodigal sons you hit rock bottom now prodigal daughters prodigal husbands prodigal wives you hit rock bottom now your eyes are wide open effort to your eyes and ears and you're running back home to the father where he's removing the old demonic robe and the old demonic rebellious shoes and he's putting on the robe of salvation on you giving you the ring of covenant and putting on the gospel shoes of peace upon you god is saying come back home oh, fully change fully change fully change metamorphosis metamorphosis for the families father restore the years the palmer worms ate up in the name of jesus in the name of jesus heal the minds those who've been dealing with mental illness those who've been dealing with mental illness that's been disrupting their lives oh god we're asking for healing in the minds in the minds in the minds god is not giving you that mind you're the mind of christ hallelujah 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 lord heal the trauma lord heal their cells their dna right now in the name of jesus i pray this for my own household father begin to heal and deliver and repair and renew and resuscitate and replenish and restore oh god and reorder reorder in the name of jesus father pour your blessings upon us your blessings make us rich and you add no sorrow in the name of jesus heal 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 physically heal 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 physically oh god heal 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 spiritually heal 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 maritally heal 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 parentally heal 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 financially heal 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 oh god oh god have mercy on us in the name of jesus Oh God, I thank you for success. Whatever David did, oh God, you gave him success. Re remove every soul from our lives. Oh God, in the name of Jesus, we slay every giant right now that's been mocking you, Father God. We come against them in the name of the Lord. We release the fiery stone of your word into the forehead of every Goliath that's been coming against us. We assassinate our wickedness. But Lord, we thank you. Hallelujah, that we're in the palace with you, Father God. At the table, the Lord, you are our shepherd. We shall not want, Father God. You make us to lie down in green pastures. Father, you lead us, oh God, beside the still waters. You, Father God, you restore our souls. You lead us to the path of righteousness for your name's sake, oh God. And yea, though we walk through the valley of the shadow of death, we will fear no evil because you are with us, oh God. Your rod and your staff, they come for us. You've prepared a table before us in the presence of our enemies. You have anointed our heads with oil in our cup overflow. Surely goodness and mercy will follow us all the days of our lives and we will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Our children will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. We and our spouses and our relatives, our tribes, we will dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Lord, I thank you and I cover this prayer in all of us with the blood of Jesus. 
And I seal this prayer in all of us with the eternal seal of the Holy Ghost. Glory to God. Oh, no more lawlessness. Oh, only righteousness, only righteousness. Hallelujah. No more chaos, only shalom, peace. Only shalom, peace. Oh, breakthrough, birth through is taking place today in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. The Holy Spirit is singing over all of us songs of healing, songs of joy, songs of victory in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah to the King of Kings and Lord, oh Lord, Lord, thank you for answering this prayer by fire because the God who answers by fire, he is God. You are God. We're on Mount Carmel. Father, I thank you that we hear the sound of abundance of rain, the raining of your will, the raining of provision, all that we need, oh God, the raining of victory. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. Talitha Kun, we arise in victory, in healing, in new strength. We arise in favor. We arise in prosperity. We arise in unity in our homes. We arise with forgiveness, mercy, and grace. We arise with solutions, godly solutions. We arise with joy. We arise, oh God, with humility. We arise with elevation. We arise on wings as eagles. We run for you, Abba, and we're not weary. We walk for you and we're not fainting. Lord, I thank you. I thank you, oh God. In the name of Jesus, we touch the hem of the garment of Jesus and we are made whole by our faith. Our faith has made us whole, well. Shalom, peace. Thank you, Lord. Send good news to us now, O oh God, at superluminal speed. I thank you that you've made a way out of no way. And we, we're going to know it's you who've done it. Father God, you said wherever two or three are gathered in your name, touching and agreeing, you will do it. And so we touch and agree with your word. Father God, that you're answering this prayer right now and forever. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen, amen, amen.